Okie dokie, just got finished with my biannual teeth cleaning. The time now is 11 11. I think I'm gonna go do a run. This won't be my first run of the year, but let's go do a run and uh, see how many miles I can get. Okay, I'm gonna see if I can knock off about three to four miles. Like I said earlier, this is not my first run of the year. Uh, I'll post up uh, that run right here. It was about three and a half miles and uh, pretty slow, but felt good. Now I'm gonna see what I can do out here today. Try and get four. Let's go. Begin workout. I gotta tell you, man, for not having run very much in the last two years, these first two runs of 2024 feel pretty damn good. I'm liking my progress already. So, all right, that's it for, for now. All right, I've got uh, a few ingredients here today and um, I thought I'd go ahead and make a carnivore snack. I was watching a lady uh, on YouTube the other day and she was making carnivore flatbread with these ingredients right here. And the ingredients are eggs, Greek yogurt, mozzarella, and provolone cheese and some bacon. Oh, it's all gonna be a good. It's my own little twist. So she was just making the uh, flat bread and I guess you could do anything with it. You can make pizza out of it, whatever. So I decided to make a little snack or you can make it a meal, whatever you want. It involves the eggs, bacon, and provolone and, and mozzarella cheese. Cook that in the oven, make the bacon. And you can make sort of a, a sandwich or a bacon wrap out of it. So anyways, I'm gonna make that today and I think it'll be good. <laughs> Start. Okay, the three ingredients you need are three, three eggs. That was a little, a little cracked already, but I'm gonna use it anyway. One, 
two. And three. Break open. There we go. Okay, I'm back. I had to go wash my hands and get the egg, egg yolk off my hands. All right, next thing I'm going to do is the Greek yogurt. And it's three quarters of a cup of Greek yogurt. And I'm just going to do it with a spoon. And I just kind of eyeball it, really. So I'll just do, I think, uh, eh, that's probably about three quarters of a cup, I'm guessing. We mix. Get it nice and smooth and creamy and frothy. All right, that's good. Now, you add the cheese. And it's a cup of cheese. So I just kind of eyeball it. Probably a little more than a cup. Mix that in there. Yeah, a little bit more. Mix it together. See that? There you go. Put some salt in there. You don't have to put salt, but I will. There, we'll mix that up. You know what? Maybe I'll put just a smidge of some pepper in all right, looks good. Mix that up. All right, it's ready to cook. Next, you get a this that way. Get a pan. Get parchment paper. Where's the end of it? Boom. Get this out of the way. Put the parchment paper on there. The oven is on and it's at 450. It's preheating right now. It should be hopefully ready to go by the time I get this on here. And just pour it on. Get all the cheese out of here. And then it how you like it you can do it in two different you can do like two separate ones if you want I just do the one big one Try to spread it out here try to make it even all right we're set beautiful right look at that almost perfectly square let's put it in the oven Put it in for 18 minutes. They say 20, but I did it for 21 time the first time and it kind of burned it, so I'm doing 18. Probably could go less, but I'm going 18. All right, while that is cooking in the oven, we'll start doing the bacon here. And I just, when I cook bacon, I always just cook the whole pack, so I'm gonna do that today. Here we go. Okay, it's ready, and you can see I can kind of pick it up, turn it over. That looks pretty cool, right? But what I do is I'll leave it on this side, and I'll add a little extra cheese. Boom. All right, the bacon is ready. Look at that. Woo! Now what I do is I get the pizza cutter right here and I'll give it the old crisscross here. Oop, there you Just like that. Now I got four separate pieces and then what I'll do from here, get some bacon. Boom. Three on there. Why not? Just like that. And then what you do, you just fold it up and you got yourself a little snack. 
Look at that. Isn't that awesome? All right, let's give it a taste. Mmm. So good. Mmm. All right, that's it. That's my carnivore flatbread bacon wrap snack slash meal. And what do you think, Caleb? That's good. I approve. Right. <laughs> I approve. Right. Caleb approves, so it's good to go. All right. Um, yeah, hope you like the video. Got a five mile run in also. My legs are kind of sore today from uh, that run, but it feels good. And uh, yeah, that's it. Flatbread, bacon. It's good. Mm. Gonna end the video here. If you like the video, give it a like, subscribe, um, hit the bell notification, leave a comment, let me know what you think. And until next time, go out and get fat with your flatbread bacon wraps. See ya.